Hello Libra and welcome to your June 2019. How do they feel about you reading? This is for Libra. We are going to see how this person is feeling and if they will take any action in regards to those feelings. It's for Libra, June 2019. How do they feel about Libra? How do they feel? about Libra for June 2019. How do they feel about Libra? How do they feel about Libra? How do they feel about Libra? We have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Okay, and then we have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So they want to get to know you, Libra, and they are very attracted to you. I mean, plain and simple. There you go. They want to know more. Initial attraction, they want to go deeper. So that's pretty good here. Let's see what's going on here. This is for Libra. June 2019. How do they feel about Libra? How do they feel about Libra? If this resonates with you, Libra, please like, share, and subscribe, and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If it doesn't resonate at all, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign. This is for Libra. How do they feel about Libra? Keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable so however that resonates with you how do they feel about libra how do they feel about libra june 2019 how do they feel about libra okay there uh, there we go keeps following you all around oh this is good stuff here oh okay so they really don't know how your feeling, okay, this is why this is here. They want to know what's behind that pomegranate curtain. <laughs> what are you hiding, Libra? They see you as a mystery, okay? They could be hiding their emotions for you as well. Or their, even their attraction, but the high priest is here. So they're using their intuition here. And they just want to know more. They see you as a mystery. Like you're not saying everything that you need to say. Um, hidden feelings, hidden emotions, a lot of mystery, right? A lot going on behind that curtain. And they, they want to rip that curtain down and to see what's going on with Libra. So very nice. Okay, so we got this King of Wands here. And this card's been following you all around um, for, I don't know, I don't even know how long anymore. But he keeps popping up, right? So, male or female. And I'm going to read the energies of the cards, but if the sign of the person that you're dealing with pops up, then all the better. Keep in mind, it can be, inter some of these energies can be interchangeable, vice versa, right? And time is fluid here. So, King of Wands, that's Fire, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. So, the attraction is most definitely there. Whoever this is, whatever sign it is, there's attraction here. And they want to go after what they want. And what they want is you, Libra. You've, you've stirred them up. You've got them going. All right? What they're looking for <clears throat> is an exchange of emotion. Okay? They want to open up to you emotionally. They want you to open up emotionally um, to them they see you as a wish fulfillment they they want to know more all right um, and you make them happy right when they think of you it's it's a good feeling um, they just want to go uh, they, they just want to go deeper here nine of cups this is water cancer Scorpio and Pisces so this is one of the happier, <clears throat> one of the happiest cards of the tarot deck. So that's very good. So they're hot for you, Libra. They want to know more about you. They, they see you as a wish fulfillment. And not only that, but most definitely a soulmate. 
energy here. We got the Six of Cups. Now, for some of you, this is somebody from your past uh, wanting to return, wanting to know you, wanting to get, get you on that deeper level. Okay, Six of Cups, more water energy here. This is somebody that thinks about you um, in a good way and thinks about you quite a bit. Okay, this is a very kind energy, a very loving energy. Um, they recognize the soul connection here. Maybe you're thinking about them too. You know, maybe <clears throat> you see them in your dreams. Maybe they're dreaming about you. Maybe, you know, you guys got a telepathic situation going on here. This is all very nice. All right, so let's pull some more cards here and see what's going on. This is for Libra, June 2019. Any more information in regards to how this person is feeling or what actions they will take in regards to Libra? How are they feeling about Libra? And what actions will they take June 2019 for Libra? What actions will they take for Libra, for Libra? Okay, they're, they themselves are not being 100% honest. And again, again with this, it's all a big mystery here. Um, they're not being 100%. I'm going to pull one more card here too because that keeps popping up. Very A lot of intuition. A lot of intuition, okay? So they have not revealed everything to you either. I feel like this is, we're not, um, the communication is probably not the best right now. Seven of swords here. This is air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But they're manifesting this. They want a new beginning here with you. Um, with this card right here, it's like either they know, especially with these two cards, they know that you are not being 100% honest about how you're feeling about them. I feel, you know, and, and I feel like they have not come clean to you about any of this either. They, they need, they want this deeper level. They want this deeper situation here with you, Libra. They're not going to tell you that they think about you all the time. They're not going to tell you that they are, you know, on fire for you. They're not going to tell you that, but they want to. And they see you as not, you know, maybe you're not ready to, to say those things. You're not ready to come clean, but they want, they want it. All right. We have the magician here. They feel like they got all the tools to make this happen here with you libra okay so they've got the sword for clear communication the cup for love the pinnacle for success and the wand for passion they want it all and um they want a new beginning here with you be careful um and i just want to say this they might um there could be a little bit of a manipulation going on especially with these two cards um to try to get um, into your good graces, so to speak. But they do want to make this happen with you. Very strong law of attraction card here. And with these two cards together, yeah, their wish is for to make this new beginning happen with you. They want to be able to offer you something solid. Okay? Um, they may feel like, you, you're not being 100% about your options here because I got two different energies, two different king energies here. <laughs> but all in all, this is Earth, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, this king of pentacles. Um, this is a situation where this person wants a strong commitment here. They want to build on a firm foundation. So not only is there passion there and not only you know do they want the emotion involved and not only do they think about you all the time but they want to make you a sincere offer right for stable long-term commitments here that's what the king of pentacles does male or female does not matter so they want to get serious it's like 
Okay, so there's this attraction here, Libra, and that's all well and good, but they want more. They want more. It's like they're going from the King of Wands, who's hot after you, to the King of Pentacles, who wants to get serious now, right? Let me pull, since we keep getting that High Priestess, <laughs> let me pull one more card here. We'll see what's going on. This is for Libra. June 2019, will they take any action? How are they feeling? Okay. Ooh, they're going to plant some seeds. They're going to see how, they're going to be very, very patient with this. Um, they're going to nurture this. They're going to nurture this like you're their baby. Okay, they want success here. They're going to be very patient and they're going to take their time. I feel like with that attraction and that heat coming off of that King of Wands, it, it was super fast. And now they want to go deeper. Okay. And they will be very patient. Sagittarius energy here. They, they're willing to take it slow and nurture the situation and make it work. It might have been a little bit... <clears throat> It's almost like this attraction just kind of blew y'all's mind here. And um, I feel like they're keeping their real emotions in check. But behind the scenes, right? Because we kept getting that high priestess with that curtain. And look, there's a curtain here. So a lot of things hidden here. I feel... Yeah, the attraction was pretty hot and heavy. But now they're realizing a lot of things. They're realizing that there's true emotion there. They're realizing the connection. And now they want to manifest. And now they want to get serious. And now they want to put time and effort into the situation. And they want to be very patient. They want to reconnect possibly and heal the situation here. Because it might have been like super hot and heavy at first. And now let's get serious here, Libra. We got the temperance card. So a lot of healing here. A lot of patience. A lot of kindness. These two cards are very kind. Very kind energies. This looks really, really good here, Libra. I feel like now they want to put in the work. Right? They want to put in the work. They really want to know your soul. Libra, that's beautiful. I like it. This is a, that's a very good reading. And um, I hope it resonates for me. Lord have mercy. All right. <clears throat> that is your June 2019. How do they feel about you reading? Um, they're going to put the work in, Libra. They're going to put the work in. Right? Let's get serious. All right. So, um, like I've said, I've put up a uh, tentative schedule for you guys um, so that you know when your videos are, your weekly videos are coming out and then uh, the, the uh, live shows, right? And I just want to let you know that I'm going to be working double time <clears throat> this month to make sure you guys have um, everything you need because I'm going on a road trip. Okay, I got to get out of here for a little bit. <laughs> So um, I'll let you know. I'll keep you updated on um, what I can get done. But I want to make sure you guys have your videos at least. The dailies may suffer a little bit. I'm not sure yet. It just depends on how far I get. So you guys take very good care. And I will be posting um, pictures, maybe even some videos of our adventures. All right. Libra, this is a very good reading. Next week, um, the mid-month check-ins will be out and um, got a lot coming towards you. You guys take very good care of yourselves and have a beautiful day. All right, take care and God bless.